Again, I'm here at the Jacksboro High School. My colleague Tiffany Liu is just about a five minute walk down the road at Jacksboro Elementary. And Tiffany, the National Weather Service told me that school in particular took some of the worst damage. Yeah, absolutely. Here at Jacksboro Elementary School, we are seeing a lot of damage and debris. I'm going to step aside here and just kind of show you, and Sam's going to walk with me, the damage here. You can see this building is entirely destroyed. There are cars that are flipped over here in this parking lot. There's just debris all over the place. It is like this at both the elementary and high school, but the strength of this community, you guys, is incredible, and there are so many heroes to thank. It only took seconds for a tornado to tear up the city. This is going to be bad. When Police Chief Scott Haynes arrived at Jacksboro Elementary School. So we start walking through here and watch, watch your step. Seeing cars turned over and the building torn, he headed toward the safe hallway. The fear was pending, not knowing if students and staff were okay. We're moving down the hallway here. I'll take you as far as we can do so safely. Around 400 people took shelter here. Students, staff, even parents who were waiting outside to pick up their kids. Finally seeing the loud, crowded hallway was a relief. One of the first students that, that I ran into literally grabbed me by my leg and hugged up on my leg, you know, and it's a good feeling to know that everybody's okay. Down the street, Jacksboro High was also heavily damaged. Principal Starla Sanders hid with three students and seven teachers. She sent everyone else home before the storm. You saved lives yesterday. <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> my wife, especially. Well, I appreciate that. I'm glad. <laughs> I got to hear barely in time. Well, I'm glad. I'm glad that y'all are okay. I love you. <laughs> As the tornado hit, she had a lot on her mind. I was kind of at a crossroads. I was at the high school trying to protect my students and my staff that were up there. But then my heart was about a mile down the road with my two boys. Sanders' kids were safe. But after a day of chaos, she drove home to this. I'm worried about that falling. Mother Nature tore up her home. Everything was wet in here. It still is wet. This storm took what can be replaced and thankfully left unscathed what cannot. It's a miracle. Yeah, it's an absolute blessing that all the kids are well. Now, a lot of cleanup is already happening here at Jacksboro Elementary School. There are also structural engineers on campus to make sure the building is safe. The superintendent does hope to resume classes by Monday. Now, I want to send it over to my colleague over in Bowie right now. William Joy is over there. William, how's it looking?